ओके सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द एनाटॉमी ऑफ द पॉपलिटियल आर्टरी एज वेल एज द पॉपलिटियल वेन सो लेट मी बिगिन विद द पॉपलिटियल आर्टरी पॉपलिटियल आर्टरी इज अ कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ द फेमरल आर्टरी वी नो दैट द पॉपलिटियल आर्टरी इज अ कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ द फेमरल आर्टरी एंड देन व्हाट हैपेंस it is a continuous femoral artery and then it actually begins at the adductor hiatus and afterwards at the lower border of the popliteus muscle it will divide into the anterior and the posterior tibial arteries it will begin at the adductor hiatus and at the lower border of the lower border of the popliteal fossa it will terminate by becoming the anterior and the posterior tibial arteries anterior tibial artery as well as the posterior tibial arteries so this is about the popliteal artery so let's discuss about the relations of the popliteal artery what about the relations anteriorly anterior to the popliteal artery we have the floor of the popliteal fossa floor of the popliteal fossa forms the anterior relation of the popliteal artery and what about the posterior posterior relation posterior relation is formed by the popliteal vein popliteal vein then we also have the tibial nerve tibial nerve and we also have the superficial fascia and the skin superficial fascia as well as skin so these are the relations of the popliteal artery anteriorly we have the floor of the popliteal fossa and posteriorly we have the popliteal vein tibial nerve superficial fascia as well as the skin so this is about the relations of the popliteal artery now let's discuss about the branches of the popliteal artery okay so now let's discuss about the branches of the popliteal artery so what about the branches we have the cutaneous branches muscular branches and genicular branches as well we have the cutaneous branches then we have the muscular branches as well as we have genicular branches genicular branches okay so when it comes to the cutaneous branches they actually pierce the roof of the popliteal fossa and then they supply the overlying skin they supply the skin of popliteal fossa the cutaneous branches and then when it comes to the muscular branches these are uh, different muscular branches they may be large as well as they may be small they supply the adductor magnus as well as the hamstring muscles they supply the adductor magnus muscle as well as the hamstring muscles which are the muscles of the posterior compartment of the thigh we have separate anatomy video on the hamstring muscles please make sure to watch that so it gives separate muscular branches to the adductor magnus as well as the hamstring muscles and then when it comes to the genicular branches it gives off the superior medial artery the lateral genicular artery actually what it gives it gives the superior superior medial genicular artery and then it gives superior lateral genicular artery so the actually these two will take part in the genicular anastomosis around the knee joint genicular anastomosis around the knee joint and then we also have the inferior medial as well as the lateral genicular arteries we have the inferior medial genicular artery as well as the inferior lateral genicular arteries and they also take part in the genicular anastomosis around the knee finally we have the middle genicular artery middle genicular artery which is supplying the synovial membrane of the knee joint synovial membrane of the knee joint so remember carefully what are the branches of the popliteal artery it gives off some cutaneous branches muscular branches as well as the genicular branches the cutaneous branch will supply the skin of the popliteal fossa and then the muscular branches will supply the adductor magnus as well as the hamstring muscles which are the muscles of the posterior compartment of the thigh and then it also gives genicular branches we have the superior medial as well as the superior lateral genicular branch they form in the uh, genicular anastomosis it also gives off branch to the inferior medial genicular branch as well as the inferior lateral genicular branch and they also take formation in the genicular anastomosis it gives a small branch which is known as the middle 
genicular branch and it is going to supply the synovial membrane of the knee joint. So this is about the popliteal artery, its branches and its relations. Now we will discuss about the popliteal vein. If you like the video, make sure to subscribe and hit the like button. Okay, so now moving on to the popliteal vein. In terms of the popliteal vein, the popliteal vein is formed at the lower border of the popliteus by the union of the veins. By different union of the veins, formation of popliteal vein takes place. What are the different union of veins? The veins which lie along the anterior and as well as the posterior tibial arteries. And we have anterior and the posterior tibial arteries, right? Tibial arteries, the veins that lie along these arteries, their union takes part in the formation of the portal vein. Afterwards, this will continue as the femoral vein. It is going to continue as the femoral vein after passing through the adductor hiatus in the medial compartment of the thigh. So, this is about the popliteal vein. And what about the tributaries of the popliteal vein? We have the small saphenous vein small saphenous vein as well as we also have the veins corresponding to the branches of the popliteal artery veins which correspond to the branches of the popliteal artery we know the branches of the popliteal artery right the genicular branches the muscular branches the veins which correspond to those arteries will combine as well as the small saphenous vein all of them will combine and their union results in the formation of the popliteal vein and this popliteal vein as it continues through the adductor hiatus in the towards the medial compartment of the thigh this is known as the uh, femoral vein in that part of the thigh so this is about the pop anatomy of the popliteal artery as well as the popliteal vein we have discussed about their relations their branches as well as the tributaries of the popliteal vein so thank you guys i'll see you in the next video bye